learning her, being with her every day, uh, it really made me, you know, want know that, that she was the one. And I, it was the first girl that I really took my time with. I, we didn't start dating until four to five months with us talking for a long time. And I tried, like, everything was special with us uh, leading up to me uh, asking her to be my wife. So, I mean, just, just the, the taking that time, I think taking that time aspect and really being able to, for both of us, really getting to know each other and uh, allowed us to really fall in love and be, you know, complete. This is a bracelet that um, Regan is wearing from her uh, great-grandmother who passed away uh, last year. And so it's a very special bracelet and it matches all of her um, beautifulness. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't going to do this. Okay. Thank you. So do you. Yes. Do you take Regan to be your wife, and do you pledge your loyalty to her in all love and honor, in all duty and service, in all faith and compassion, to live with her and cherish her according to the holy bond of marriage? Do you? I do. Dalton to be your husband, and do you pledge your loyalty to him in all love and honor, in all duty and in service, in all faith and compassion, to live with him and to cherish him in the holy bond of marriage, do you? I do. With this ring, I declare, I am my beloved's. I am my beloved's. And my beloved is mine. And my beloved is mine. Where you go, I will go. Where you go, I will go. 
Where you lodge, I will lodge. Where you lodge, I will lodge. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Regan, will you take this ring and slip it onto Dalton's finger and repeat after me. With this ring, I declare. With this ring, I declare. I am my beloved's. I am my beloved's. And my beloved is mine. And my beloved is mine. Where you go, I will go. Where you go, I will go. Where you lodge, I will lodge. Where you lodge, I will lodge. As long as we both shall live. May God be gracious unto you and bless you in your going out and in your coming in. May he make his face to shine upon you and give you peace. Amen. You may kiss your bride. You know, I, I can't think of a, a, a better time to spend with your daughter than the, the past two years. It's not goodbye. It's just welcome to the family. We didn't lose a daughter. We gained a son. But... Like I told you when you asked me if it was okay for you to marry my daughter, you take care of my princess. And she is a princess. And I will tell you right now, you are in way over your head. <laughs> I've known Dalton since we were in elementary school, so I've known Dalton a long time. We grew up together, went to college together, we shared a room in college, so I've known this guy forever. So if anyone says they know Dalton, they don't know him like I know him. I know Dalton, that's my dude. Destiny is, is amazing. You know, this is a blessing for both of these guys. You know, I'm so happy for Dalton, I'm so happy for Regan, I'm so happy for everyone that's here, happy for the families, and this is, this is an awesome experience. I hope that you two enjoy it. I hope that is fruitful. You know, I would love to be Uncle Reggie someday. So, you know, hey, definitely, you know, like I say, man, I hope you guys enjoy it. Hope everything is great. You know, enjoy it. My name's Carrie. I'm Regan's younger sister. Regan has always been my best friend through the 22 years I've spent with her. I've always been able to talk to her about anything, literally anything. I've always looked up to Regan and the things she's accomplished in life, graduating college, getting a great job, and working her tail off to be where she is today. 
Regan is very near and dear to my heart and she holds a special place in our family. Without her, we wouldn't be rushing around every Sunday to get to twerk church 20 minutes late. <laughs> we twerk too. <laughs> <laughs>